I just want to plant the seed of possibility and change some perspective about rural Alberta. This whole event was based on uh, retaining and bringing in some medical professionals, so from doctors, nursing, uh, really looking at the need that we have. We have an aging community, uh, at the, and the fact is we did have a situation where we're actually, we're potentially short. So alarm bells went off and we got together, a uh, group of the town, I'm with the county, I'm the reeve of the county, and we got together and said, hey, let's, uh, let's see what we can do to promote the community, and then the Skills Weekend came up and it was a great opportunity to showcase what we have to offer. I think it's an area where there's a ton of need um, and I think a lot of people sometimes think that rural medicine is quiet and you don't get to do very much but in areas especially like Rimby that's completely opposite to what we find um, as physicians we have a lot of skills we do everything from obstetrics to internal medicine to geriatrics to high acuity um, emergency medicine so it's a great breadth for us. Oh, that's so cool. Um, the nurses also find that they really have a large breadth of experience and they can do a little bit of everything and also get to do a lot more than they would in the city. Um, so they really like that and um, really for any healthcare professional it just tends to be a lot more exciting than you would find in your less pigeonholed and you can do a lot more things with your, with your time. I took part because I wanted to see what the rural communities had to offer for healthcare professionals and kind of what Rimby had to offer. Um, I have drove past here a bunch of times um, on the highway while I've gone to visit my sister and just never really stopped off, so why not take a look? It was really cute getting to see like all the community come together and even just welcoming us. And then it was nice that they had like a live band and they had the two uh, princesses come and show us a little bit of horse riding. Yeah, it was really nice just kind of getting a feel for what it's like to be in the community itself. I remember these skills days when I was a medical student, people would come back and just rave about how good they were. So it was awesome to sort of capture that enthusiasm that I remember from six years ago when I was a medical student for a second year. Um, and to, to have that come into our community and just to show the students a few things and tell some stories and um, talk a little bit about what it's like to practice in a smaller town like Rimby, uh, that was really fun. I like the idea of going up north into rural, more remote areas, but I also, specifically talking about Rimby, I, I find it to be a very interesting community in that there's 2,500 people, which is the size of the town that I went to high school in, but it's got a, a full hospital with emergency, uh, with mental health services, with inpatient, outpatient, long-term care, acute care. Um, there's so much diversity of health care that's already here for, for such a rural area. I was quite impressed with Rimby and it's definitely some, it's a place that uh, I'll be thinking of in the future. I think my favorite uh, portion would have been uh, the dinner that we had uh, out in the riding arena. Uh, to me, like that, that was just like being at home kind of thing. So uh, it was a very, very country feel to it. Uh, very rural. You really got a sense of what the community is really like out here. I've always kind of seen myself working in the city, but actually spending some time out here, you kind of see the town. You know, there's all the amenities you want. So uh, I could definitely see the lifestyle attracting me. I have been to a racetrack before, yeah. I've gone to Castrol, I've gone to the Darwell tractor pull a few times, so I, I've been around these a couple times. It's good fun. I like it. If anyone asks me today, I already programmed myself. This is where I want to grow, I want to develop myself. I will always tell them to give it a try. It's it's worth it and they don't have anything to lose. I think this, it's all about networking. Tell your friends, rural Alberta is alive and well and it's doing great and good place to live and, and, and to work. <laughs>